Brigitte came out with a new handheld vacuum. This is the MX30 and I cannot wait to test it. This is my third Brigitte vacuum and I'm using this one, the H5, as my daily. So I'm looking forward to this review because as of now, Brigitte always delivered the goods. Got a new drip from Brigi. This is the MX30 handheld vacuum. By the way, if you're interested already, then check out the product links in the description. I will list and link the best deals for you. And now let's check it out. So here we have the box, simple box. Here we have all the specs and the data on the back. Bottom is blank. Here on the side, we have an overview of everything that's in the box. And here we have data about the company. Let's get to it. Brigi makes life simpler. And here we have it, nice padding and all the accessories inside this tray on the bottom. Okay, padding and here we have it, but before we get to it. So here we go, nice tray right here. First of all, we have the base right there, good looking injection mold right there, well part. <laughs> Anyways, reminds me of the H5, then here we have then here we have the two-in-one brush nozzle, straight end, and also with the brush, of course. Looking good, super snappy, great build quality. And we can put it in the base, just like that. Actually, maybe like that, OCD. And then we also have the multi-surface tool right here. I have high hopes in this, for the car especially, we'll get to it. But yeah, this is what it looks like. This will pick up and loosen up the debris and hairs and all of that good stuff. Yeah, and then it will get sucked in. So, and lastly, we have a charging cable, of course, USB-A to USB-C, good length. And then we also have this, this overview right here, little operation guide, cleaning and maintenance, and also how to clean out the filter. And then we also have a detailed user manual right here, multi-language, of course, one and two. Yeah, and that's actually it. Well, this is actually more detailed, but yeah. So accessories and paperwork. So done with the unboxing. Let's get to my first impressions and then of course to a close overview. So here we go. Quite compact, nice transparent dust cup. Great seal, you can feel it. Great rubber seal right there. So this is tight for sure. And it's also super stable, great tolerances. And yeah, the body is matte gray charge part so yeah little test <laughs> sounds like a brie vacuum all right let's take a close look so let's start with the dust cup right here this is what it looks like from the front and we have this flap in here that will of course stop the dust from falling out again. Then next up we have this section right here and we can also take out the filter of course. Intuitive and simple system. We have the mesh on the outside. This is what it looks like on the top by the way. And the HEPA filter, you can just pull it out. So that's the mesh part and that's the actual filter in here. So usually this was hard plastic, now this is more like a rubber. So I think this will give you a way better seal. So great improvement on this front. And then we have the handle part with the motor inside great suction power plenty strong yeah we have the mentioned rubber seal right here branding on the side this is where the air will leave of course right here we also have USB-C charging and all these infos on the well on the bottom basically and you can stand it up like so. Screw holes on the other side and a nice rounded handle. Yeah, super economic and compact form or rather shape. And to put it back together, filter and dust cup. And up here we have the status LED that will tell us everything about the vacuum, charge level, on off status, all of that good stuff. <laughs> press and hold to turn it on and short press to deactivate it. See? You need to press and hold. Simple as that. And to put it all together, we have the base station, the accessories, and then right here, the vacuum. This is what it looks like. And now, let's see how it will snap in nicely. Nice, really nice. We have this little notch right here for extra stability. So yeah, quite a few little upgrades. Really like it. 
I really like it. it. Snaps in place really nicely, so great tolerances for sure. Oh, this is even, ah, this is genius. This is a bit rounded. Can't wait to test it. Good stuff. Now let me tell you all about the specs and the features. The cool thing about Brigi vacuums is that the specs are always on there. So charging voltage, 5 volt DC, battery capacity 22.2 watt hours, power 65 watts, and the charging current 500 all the way up to 2000 milliamps. And we also have the size on here. It weighs 510 grams and I will get to the rest in the outro. So not bad, right? And now let's finally test it. First of all, indoors and then outdoors. Let's go. So let's start with something simple. Wow. Super strong suction power, as you can see, with this two-in-one accessory. Pretty much stays the same. Well, the power level, of course, it has the same diameter. And then with this multi-surface tool, nice. Still plenty of suction power. So this is what it will look like. Nice cyclone effect. And again, thanks to the rubber flap, everything will stay inside. Yeah, now let's give it a real world test. There is a literally no better test for a vacuum than cleaning out a car because inside of a car, <laughs> there are just so many different things collecting. So we're talking about breadcrumbs, we're talking about nature stuff, we're talking about debris from the ground, all sorts of crevices. It's just perfect. So let's get right to it. This of course makes total sense for the brush. Amazing. But yeah, just as expected, strong suction power. We'll get it done. Then of course, detailing. That's of course where the brush attachment shines. Perfect. And you can also get in here. Now look at that, way better. Also for the dashboard, everything. You get the point inside the doors. Done. So the two-in-one brush tool is amazing. And now I want to try this one. And the reason why is this down here. In many cars, there is this fabric and this is actually fairly hard to clean, to demonstrate. I will pull back the brush. As you can see, it's kind of stuck in here. So I have high hopes that this will get it out. So let's see. Yes, sir, just like that. So you get the point, but you can of course also use it here. Oh, this is actually a great surface. You could also do it with the brush, but with this you can do it in just one go. What is this? Why is this so stuck? Wow, super stuck. Check it out. One, two, three, four. And it's clean. Doing this with the two-in-one would take quite a bit longer, I assume. Yeah, and with just two accessories, you can basically do everything. So yeah, great little device, works amazingly well. And it also fits underneath here without any problems. So I think I will keep it in the car. I wanted one for the car for ages. So big thumbs up from my side. This inside the door. Look at that, super happy. So as you saw, multi-purpose, multi-surface, super affordable. Great specs and features for the price point. But yeah, it goes without saying, Brig is always very budget friendly with their products. It's also a super light build, but still has quite a lot of power for the size. 12, 12 kPa of suction power. And that is plenty for a small handheld device like this, to say the least. Strong battery, long runtime for the size, of course, around 18 minutes. So you should easily get the job done with, well, with a full battery. Quick clean of the whole car, 
should be no problem. You will also get a neat base station for storing all the accessories, of course, and also the vacuum itself, of course. So yeah, all in all, a neat little package right there. Definitely drippy. Check out the product links in the description if you're interested. But before you go, smash that like button, then subscribe, ring the bell and click all to never miss amazing tech magnet videos. That's it for this one. Enjoy your day and I will see you soon.